In this video, I'm going to show you how you can install and use the Side Store app for iPhone to install the IPA files. Now, to sideload the Side Store app, we're going to need one IPA signer and installer app. There are lots of apps which can do this. For example, KSign, eSign, Feather, Scarlet, etc. I have the KSign installed here and it's totally working. And I can use it to sign and install the IPA files. For this purpose, if you want to install and set up the KSign app on iPhone, go to the video link in the description. Once you have the KSign app installed and set up on your iPhone, we can proceed now. Firstly, we'll need the Side Store IPA file. Go to Safari. Go to the first link here, sidestore.io. Scroll down. And just download the sidestore IPA. Tap here, download sidestore IPA. And download. Once it's been downloaded, we can go back to home screen. Launch the cache line. Now come to the library tab and tap on plus here. We can import the sidestore file and import the sidestore 2 IPA that we had just downloaded. Tap. Once it's imported, tap on this app and tap on sign and install. Start signing. Install. It's been done. If you go back to home screen now, side store has been installed here. Now if you tap on this app here, it will give you this screen showing that you'll need the pairing file. So we can have to get the pairing file firstly. Now to create the pairing file for side store, you will compulsorily need your PC. On your PC, just go to the side store link that I have given in the description. It will lead you to this web page here, side store pairing file. Now before proceeding further, I'm gonna make you clear that we'll need iTunes for this purpose. I have the iTunes installed on PC here. So once the iTunes has been installed, let's go to the same web page here and you're gonna need this ID device pair. So click on Windows Ops since we are using the Windows. Let the ID device pair download. Once it's been downloaded, we're going to have to install it. Click on more info, it's totally safe and run anyway. Allow. It shows here no device is connected. So we can have to connect the iPhone to PC using the USB cable. Let me connect it. And you'll get this prompt on the iPhone. Trust the computer. And input the passcode of iPhone. Just refresh it here. Select device. Now we're going to click on generate option here to create the pairing file. Once the pairing file has been created, you have several options here. You can either save this file to any directory or you can directly install this pairing file to your side store app if side store is installed on your iPhone. In my case, side store app is installed on the iPhone. So I can just tap on install on the PC here and it has succeeded here. Now I can launch the side store app on iPhone and it will just work here. Yes. Now there's one more thing for side store that is if you go to app section inside the side store and tap on plus here it shows here that we have to configure the wireguard vpn for the side store app to work properly so let's configure the wireguard vpn firstly go back launch app store and install the wireguard vpn here now before launching go back to home screen launch your safari will need the side store configuration file for wireguard just google search side store wireguard configuration file github and click on the first link here from github that is side store wireguard config it will automatically download the configuration file here tap and download once the file has been downloaded we can now launch the wireguard launch wireguard tap on plus to add the tunnel and tap on create from file or archive and we're gonna choose the side store configuration file allow and give your touch id now enable this now we're gonna exit the side store from the app switcher and now relaunch it back side store now if we go to app section here let's refresh it once and tap on plus here it totally works to install the ips now go to any ipa on your iphone import any ipa file now you're gonna have to log in with your apple id and password it's doing its work and you can see here this app has been successfully installed and seven days remaining we can refresh it anytime and if you go to home screen it's here already so that's how we can install the side store on iPhone to install the IPA files. Like this video and subscribe to this channel.